videos of dates and time now. 29th of November 2018, Thursday. Okay, this is a male guinea pig one year old, so right? New third of year. Now, I just want to compare this male to the, just not the female. First of all, there is no hair loss, right? There. No hair loss, huh? On the side, on the flank, we call it. Huh? For the last two weeks. In the other side. This is the, this is the sibling, right? Uh, the pet shop owner said no hair loss. You see no hair loss, huh? Which is the normal situation. Situation in uh, normal guinea pigs, huh? Look at good weight. Now, the only trouble with this one is, I notice there seems to be some urine scalding right there. This is a urine, right? Mm. How come? The, normally, they don't have this. Uh, has, has, has he got any diarrhea? No. He has been neutered. Uh, he has been neutered last month, is it? Uh, Sometime ago. I think it's January. Mm, okay. So, I just want to compare with the other one, the female. The female is here there. Now you can see the female, there is a hair loss, uh, hair loss at the flanks. Uh. There, this is obvious here. Yeah. Uh, you can see here. Uh, in the other video, but anyway, you can see here, so there, due to biting and uh, scratching with the back legs, biting both sides are like, symmetrical. Oh, we have to take out, huh? oh, this one is of course bigger size. Now you can see here there. See flank one. This reminds you of the dogs with ear ear hepatitis, uh, ear ear infections. They normally scratch the the sides, huh? Okay, this side, so I see this side. Okay, come. Huh? Now this this girl a bit a bit nervous. I just show let's see. Ball patches, no hair here. There. Okay, at first I suspect, I suspect it's due to uh, due to mounting uh, by the male. The other possibility, of course, is a shampoo, which has uh, gone deep in, and and causes itchiness, itchiness below. Uh. So when I touch here, you see this one really doesn't like it. It's a vertical vertical ear canal here. Turn this side and see. I place down first. Now you can see, uh, just comparison. No, no, not so, not so nervous now. But there's some pain. Uh. Okay, now I compare with the male. Okay, put it back first. Now the male first. Of all, I will just check first. Now this one. Remember, there's no hair, hair loss on the flanks. I check the ears. Yeah. Now you see that the opening is quite big actually compared to the other one. The ear opening, the ear canal opening is big, that means there's, it's not swollen. No? And if it's not swollen, of course, there's no infection or inflammation. No, I'm just to put in. I notice that there's no squealing back the other side. Come. Of course, guinea pigs don't like it. No? Something going into the ear canal, but you can see it's not so swollen. It's very hard to compare, but, but if you see the other video, the opening is very small <coughs> in the other guinea pig. Now I put my, my scope in, ear scope. This one I can go in further, but uh, and there's no objection. Okay. Then now let me just pop it. Huh? See if it's painful or not. Now, this, the other one wasn't so happy. Now normally there should not be any pain. But oh, this one is so not happy. Yeah. This one has shampoo also, right? Yeah. On this side. Some of the shampoos, the chemicals might be irritating to the eardrum. Yeah. Some of them be just not happy with you touching the ears. Okay, finish. So we will try irrigate this.